keep going. This, this is a book on the Chester. It tells you all about it. And this is a the history of the U-505 submarine in 1933 and 34, I think. Part of my Ellis County honor flight. This is diaries where I wrote while I was in the war. Mm. So anybody can take them out and read them if they want to. And the band played on. This is little papers they issued out on the ship ever so often. Some of the comics that say people take this out and look at them if they want to. Here. BJ Day. Uh, BJ uh -huh. Day. Everybody said whoopee when they, <laughs> <laughs> when, when they broadcast this. Uh. I don't know if you can see that or not. These are tags. That's a whole that folds down. But these come off the bags of powder on an eight inch gun. And when, where we bombarded that day, I took one off. These different places there, Wake Island, uh, looks like Parmashiro. You know where this one is? Iwo Jima. We were there at Iwo Jima about three or four or five times. This one's upside down, I think. Friday morning. Iwo Jima again. No, that was Ha Ha Jima. That's another little island up there. <laughs> that we softened, softened up for the Marines. Yep. Hello, folks. How old were you there? Eighteen. That's 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 the start, huh? That was the start. That was taken in Pearl Harbor after we got there. So I mailed it back to my family. Hello folks. Yeah. <laughs> well there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's another. There's that one was taken on the, while I was home on on my after boot camp. And that was taken at one of the Navy yards that we, whoops, yeah. Huh. I didn't, I didn't bring, uh, now this is a dedication ceremony where I laid my brick at the, uh, Admiral Nimitz Museum in Fredericksburg. Oh, you got a brick down there? Yes, sir. I laid it last June. I'm going to have to go find it next yeah. time I'm in Fredericksburg. Well, when you go behind the, to the military walkway, yeah. where they've got all those ships, I walk down that right-hand one over there, and it's about halfway down there, you'll see the Chester's. Uh, on the wall, on the right? On the wall, on the wall, and then right down there on the walkway. All right, I'm going to find it next time I'm I down there. Brick, I got my brick laying there. You can step on it, stomp on it. <laughs> you want to do. Yeah. Well, that's my 92nd birthday. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Letters from the kids. And this is a map of Iwo Jima. If you oh, really? look at it. Yeah. And I've got one just like it hanging on my wall that's bigger than that. You know what we what we might not just wait till the till my Michelle and Kevin get here. Okay. Looks like looks like somebody's here. Kevin's here. Yeah. And uh, we'll spread it out on the okay. table. This is Japanese writing paperwork out of the 
a bombed out uh, gun emplacement there on Saipan. Where we went in and picked up all his papers. You ever had it translated? Nah. I've been wanting to. There's Japanese money that they give hey, us. Come to, on in, Kevin. Give us to buy. Let's see. Yeah, that's right side up that way. This is Bobby Osborne. This is my cousin, Kevin Helms, Bobby. Kevin. Bobby? Kevin, good to meet you. Yeah. Uh, he's, he's, show, he's going through his stuff. I'm videotaping it. <laughs> then we'll talk about it on the, on the deal. Yeah, that's what Did you see this gun? Check out his gun. He got it off. Which island did you get that off? Saipan. Saipan. And that's a, a what's the night? What's the type of rifle? <laughs> yeah, I can't, can't think no. This come with it. <laughs> that's the that's the bayonet. Yeah, it, it come with it. It had shrapnel in the back of it so before it come off. A dead soldier. <laughs> yeah. What got him, huh? Yeah. Mm. Is over here with the gun. This man is what they give to the all the personnel on the island if we had made it. This was their their weapon. Mm -hmm. It's a bayonet, but it's just a bar of steel. So you so who gives it? Who gave you that? I got this out of a big warehouse there at the at the Omanato naval base that we occupied when the war was over. But that was that was the home front man it was still fit a rifle. Oh. So mm. if we had a rifle. Mm. Yeah, we was all This is another one with just like it. It's a, I don't know where it come it come off probably come off Okinawa. I mean the Okinawa. Uh, Friend that gave it to me was there a lot. Got a different finger guard on. And you want to set those out here, Bobby? Yeah. I'll set them on the, on the desk. Yeah, they, they got different. See, mine, mine are where it got the curl. Yeah. That's the, that's the original. Oh, the guard? You're talking about with the curl on it? Yeah. Liz Palmer, down at the motorcycle shop, made this up. She took all my stuff and went through it and put it all together. Different things. They put a little navy suit there. That's where I got my brick there. Fixing to put it down. And Fredericksburg says he's got a brick at the, at the uh, museum in Fredericksburg. Yeah. <laughs> right in front of me. Uh, Ship's plaque. Now it's getting old. <laughs> this is my dad's <laughs> dress, dress cap from World War One. <laughs> and neckerchief. So this is my dress cap. It's smaller. <laughs> it's got U.S. Navy on it. His has got his. Ship's name on it here. So y'all were both Navy men. Yeah. USS Talbot. Talbot. It was it was a destroyer. Huh. Getting old, getting old. <laughs> Japanese gas mask are part of it. It's kind of got blowed up in the. <laughs> one bit when the brain flooded. So I salvaged this. Mm -hmm. You had a bad day. Yeah. That j all them jacks hold it. That's what I carried all during the war. Oh, uh, man. Your territory. Yeah, mm -hmm. pull it out. Let's see. He carried that the whole war. Yeah. Looked like it'd been sharpened a time or two. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> been sharpened. And chopped a million hamburgers. <laughs> <laughs> you got any markings on it? Do you know who made it? No. I don't see any markings <clears throat> on it. 
I tell my grandfather's now. I, I made this now. You made the sheath? Yeah, I made the sheath for it. So the Navy gave you this knife? No, my dad. Your dad? He sent that to me. And you carried it all the yeah. years you were in the war? Yeah. That's awesome. You know what that is? That's a Japanese fishing ball. Really? That's what they float their nets with. Oh. Really? Yep. If you said ball, I thought bobber maybe, but yeah. I guess no. it makes the net. And they wrap the string around it, you know, oh. net, and it floats their nets out there. <laughs> they have a whole string of them on it. Yeah. I got two of them. They make them all different sizes. If they had a great big heavy net out there, you'd have one that's big around. <laughs> have, you know, a dozen of them out there. Uh, you got your kukri. Is that what that's called? Yeah. That's yeah. What, I thought it was a banana that, knife. Yeah, they call the them cookies. That, that, give, that give me that other band out there, also give me this. Uh, he was at Okinawa, him and another boy was on guard duty on their ship. Watch, gun watch. Mm -hmm. The Japs were swimming out and throwing hand grenades on the ship yeah. or climbing up on them. On yeah. Them. Well, they was on watch and two Japs climbed up on the board and Jumped on them, but they took care of the Japs. And he took that off, <laughs> off the one that he he killed. So one of the Japanese had this. Um, yeah. So, I didn't know they used kukris in the, mm -hmm. the Japanese. They used everything they get to. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I guess in that in that situation, yeah, it's shit. Like you guys did too. Yeah. Anything you get your hands in. One of my original dog tags with a chain. Oh man. Bobby e. Osborne. There it is. So what's the numbers on here? It says Bobby e. Osborne. They spelled my name wrong. <laughs> they spelled it. With I E. Put an I E on the end of it said a Y. Yeah, it's eight three nine two one ninety eight. Yeah. What is that? I could have told you what it was before I ever looked at it. Eight three nine two one. That's your number. <laughs> <laughs> that's your number. That was my number. And then B T dot four <laughs> slash forty three. That's when. The, that's when I end up to me. That's when you entered. Yeah. Four April of forty three. Well, that's when I went on board the ship. Oh, that's when you went aboard the Chester. Yeah. We went. In, they took me in March the twelfth. Yeah. And a USNRP, what is that? Uh, 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 reserve. They call us reserve. Yeah. Chopsticks. <laughs> Come, I took them right off the dining table. <laughs> I tell you, I need some of them. I might lose some weight. Uh, yeah. <laughs> get rid of that fork. And, and I bought these at the stores when they let us go ashore there on. The big island of Ocadio. <laughs> That's what they give us that money for it to spend. That Japanese money? Yeah. And that, that, I don't know what it costs. But these is what I wanted to get. Looks like a sewing needle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what they repaired their nets with. Nets with. Yeah. Yeah. She had to pull the string around. Ah. <laughs> Uh. Well, we don't have to get down deep in here to get the rest of this out. You want me here? I can put it up on the chair so you don't have to keep bending over. Yeah, well, part of my sewing kit that we had. Big, big, big sail needle. <clears throat> Stuff to hold, hold it together before you, while you sew it. Beeswax. So they gave the navy gave you that. Yeah, all this here. I, I salvaged this from somewhere. I forget where I got this. Over there too. It come from over there too. I think I got it out of that warehouse. 
it's got holes in it to let the water out. Uh, <coughs> you set that up here. Michelle, the quay is supposed to be coming. Is it? Yeah. When I was wandering around up, up on the, close to the cemetery, on the Nato naval base up there, we circled all around it. There was no, no more uh, Marines or no uh, men around. All women in the houses up on them. Where are they staying? We were walking around and they wouldn't, told us not to eat anything because they used some of human fertilizers to do gardens. So, little, this is one of them and she tried to give us food and I, we wouldn't take it. So, she gave me this. Huh. Ain't good looking? Now you know what? Hey, you know what these are? What? The clothespins. Oh man! Bobby, this hey, is this is Michelle Lacroix. Michelle? Ah. That's Michelle. Stuff here. Yeah, well, she, he's going through the stuff <laughs> he brought. Oh, cool. You better come in here. Get on the inside, How Michelle. You like? You're gonna be in that chair over there when we do the podcast. Uh -huh. No idea what you're getting me into. Bamboo. Mm. That's cool. Anyway, that little Japanese lady gave me this doll, and it's come apart. My my nieces and kids. Everybody played with it? Yeah, they played with it and Look broke the feet. I'm telling him. That's all bamboo? That's a clothespin. Clothespin? How do you use it? Squeeze it. I'm afraid to. <laughs> Look at that! Oh yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. How many? Hold on. Oh, that's a little bit of grass coming apart. I took it. So I just kept it like that. <laughs> yeah. Grandkids? Yeah, grandkids. <laughs> <laughs> You see his dog tag over there and his, his gun. He, he took this off of one of the islands with a bayonet. Has they got notches? She shelled from a couple of three of the islands that walked on. Just went along the beach and just picked them up. I had more than that, but I made a bunch of things for some other people. Look at that. That's beautiful yeah, right yeah. there. Cat's eyes. They call them cat's eyes. Just something. Didn't have no room to put much of anything. No. I can't believe you, you kept all the stuff you did. I walked full of these. Yeah. Yeah. Walk around on, with pocketfuls? Yeah. When I went back on board ship. Yeah. This is the deck. This, off the deck of the Chester. When they chomped it up. In 54, 55. They sold it for scrap iron. Mm. Carried it to Florida and chomped it up. Mm. The deck of wood? Yeah. That's oak. The whole front, there was a deck up on the front was oak, and then the stern where they loaded the powder back there had an oak deck. It would keep sparks down. Mm -hmm. it would keep having sparks when they load that powder. I didn't know they had wood decks. Not either. Not either. <laughs> Makes sense. That is cool. Yeah. Don't want nothing skipping across no metal, causing no sparks in the, yeah. in the powder. She hadn't seen that neither. I don't know that. Ooh, what is this? Fishing, Fishing ball. ball. Oh, is it now? <laughs> That's what they floated their nets with. Did they tie nets to that? Glass. Wouldn't last for long around It wouldn't no. last for long around nowadays, they don't, for sure. He said the bigger the net, the bigger the bobber. Yeah, no, really? Right. He just has a treasure trove of stuff, yeah. doesn't he? Yeah. How do they hook them on? They wrap a little net around it and then tie it to the top of their just, net. I see. And make floats their nets out in the water to catch fish. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Different sizes, hand bone. Part of them. Just got one start on here, but we our ship had six, I think. Battles. 
That three or generations of books here, a little Bible. I can't believe I can the family. Oh man. And my dad was in the Navy, and one of his brothers was in the Navy, and one was in the Army. I got them. And you kept all their Bibles? I've got all of them. I've accumulated this many. The New, the New Testament. That's Navy. That's it. Two Navies. That and whole. That's it. I think that's Dad's. Were you issued a Bible? Yes. Really? Yes, they issued it. New Testament. New Testament. They didn't oh, give you the Old like, Testament? It's like duffel. Now this is my here. Okay. Mark 17, 1943, Navy Department. Oh, oh these are fragile. Yeah. And where did y'all keep these? On you? In her pocket or in her locker or wherever. Most of the time I kept it in the locker because you never know when you're going to be wet. Because it's made out of the material like... Okay. Sort of a canvas type. Yeah. yeah. These are made out of a different. A leather? Sort of a. Yeah. Leather. Oh, I... yeah. And you have all your grandfathers, your fathers, and yeah. yours. And that man. Yeah. All the years. So was your grandfather in the military? Well, one of them. Oh, this is my son. <laughs> And this is Japanese goggles that come out of it. Pit where that gas, gas mask mask come from. Uh, it was blowed up when the Marines were blowed that gun pit up with them. Kind of blew the rest of it up too. <laughs> he said that guy had a real bad day. Uh, I bet he did. <laughs> what was this part of like a visor or his that, goggles? And this goggles are probably a the motorcycle runners or somebody oh, on the yeah. island going from one place to the other. And he, he must have been there when they blew that up. This, this is what they call a palm, palm shield. For sewing, poking your needle through canvas. Yeah. It's got a metal. And what did y'all have to sew? Canvas. Tarps or sails? Uh, yeah, we're not sails, we're just tarps or different tarp. things. Yeah. And we sewed, sewed canvas around the lifelines, canvas, uh, cable lifelines. Uh huh. To keep it falling over. Just put canvas on there and we sew them up, paint them white. Punch it for that. <laughs> this is what they repaired their. Uh, Nets with. And I was I was the primer man on that. that I wound it up there. It's just so they can sew it in, uh -huh. in their net. Sew it and yeah. weave it or whatever. Yeah, weave it in where they tie it get off. tore. Yeah, if they got a hole tore in it, they take that and weave it in there. That is cool. I was the primer man on an eight-inch gun, and that's what I. Was. That's the primer. That's the primer, blank forty-five seventy. <laughs> that's that's was back way back in the in the Civil War, forty-five seventy, and all the westerns. I wore a belt to them, and when that big breach, when that eight-inch gun would open and lay down to load it, load it, it had another little breach on the front of that big old thing, and I'd open it up and put my holes in it and close it and get back out of the way. And then. It, they, by then they'd done a load of shells and the powder and the 
the breach was fixing to close. Mm -hmm. And it was all air and hydraulic operated and you didn't get your hand in the you way. You didn't get your hand in the way. No, you don't get your hand in the way. Pulling up. <laughs> you have to blink. That's what we stamped all our clothes with and still got my name, Osborne. You had ink it in? <laughs> Look at that. B -E so anything you own, you yep. put your stamp on stamp it. Stamp on it. Here, you like these. I don't know if I'm reading it right. Oh, look. <laughs> and just, it opens up, unfolds. Oh, it unfolds? Yeah, just grab both each end of it here. Oh, I'm afraid it'll break it. This, <laughs> we got two of them here. Oh, now who are all, do we know who any of these are? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> That's something you took off the island, huh? Yeah. I think I got them at Pearl Harbor. And what was the purpose of these? This is just their loved ones or something? Or their uh, girls that they took with them? Or, just like, uh, or is it kind of like Playboy? I don't know. Maybe before the time. Maybe yeah. before the time. No. Yeah, this is pocket knife I Oh, the Navy yeah, issue? Keep pocket knife that they issued. I think these geisha girls were meant or something. Those are memories. Yeah. More of our bar. I got a friend next door that might contain See, there's that. one with three on it, and here's one with one on it for our battle stars. This is that three. This is a duplicate of that one there. Do you just get stars for battles at sea? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not for softening up the land or anything? No, we, if we soften up a lot of islands. Mm -hmm. There's your pocket knife back, Bobby. And that was issued? Yeah, that. That's the pocket knife? That was the pocket knife. You can open it. I think it's still open. Look at the little lock. No, I'll put that on there. Oh. Keep. So what all did you get issued? A knife, a Bible. That's all. And uniform, clothes. and that's it. That's your clothes. A knife and a Bible and a uniform. It's a shoe brush, polished shoes with. <laughs> oh, well, that's important, isn't it? No rifle. You get a rifle? Nope. 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 Not on the ship. Not on the ship. The only time we had that rifle was when we invaded. Oh, and I told you, Pan Naval Base, after the war, when the war ended. I'll let you take that and read it. And, you and then, you, then, you let, then you can let her see it if she wants to. <laughs> Silver Dollar Hotel. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. There I have it. I know all about the Silver Dollar anything. Well, that's... They got one up in Dallas, good too. Good for one screw. Yeah. <laughs> Is that what it says? Yeah, that's what it says. <laughs> yeah, see that. <laughs> For real. <laughs> Silver Dollar Hotel, good for one screw. Madam Ruth Jacobs, proprietor, Denver, Colorado. Mm. Hey, yeah, yeah, you're, you hey, yeah, you're an oak tree, Bobby. You're an oak tree to oh, keep that, man. Check three dollars. You, you know, uh, shoot, a, I, I don't know if I had to survive. <laughs> yeah, no, we would have survived Madam Ruth. Yeah. Madam Ruth Jacobs. How did you come about one of these? <laughs> How did the guys get one of these? They hand you one when you walk off the ship? No, I, I think I acquired that from Colorado. <laughs> he, he had a handful when he got there. <laughs> He only, <laughs> he only come back with one. <laughs> That's right. Now, now they issued these to us. This was the first aid handbook. And this was survival of land and sea. You had a book, not a class? No. Really? They just give you a book and say, read it? Both read them. Know it, learn it. And this was a, open. I acquired this from somebody on the ship that was... A little prayer book. Department of the Interior Bureau of Mines manual. Well, if you got hurt in the mine, the I guess. Congressman, I can't read his name. The 11th Texas District.
Learn it. You can't Don't play, forget it. You can play mm -hmm. cards, but you can only understand it because they're Japanese. Hmm. Deck of cards. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's what's on it. Let's see. They got a picture on the front and a picture on the back of each one of them. Okay. I'm showing off any ankle or nothing. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see. Yeah. Queen of clubs. <laughs> There's a story to be told right here if we can find somebody to translate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got a friend next door that reads Mandarin. I don't know if that will help, I don't know with, if Japanese. help with Japanese. Yeah. That is cool. A prayer book. I'll catch on fire if I hold it in. Oh, now. It doesn't look like Fair Kathy's enough. Bible. I'm Kathy's saying. the most used Bible I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> she, she still got that same one? Yeah, she's still got it. Let's take a look. Uh, not too familiar. This is published for the Army and Navy Commission of the Protestant Epos Episcopal Church by the Church Pension Fund, New York City, 1941. Wow. Yeah, all kind of. Oh my gosh. Okay. Shells. What does those big bazookas go in? That's a 20 millimeter. That's a 50, 50, mil, 50 caliber. 50 caliber. So this, is, so this is a 50 caliber machine. Yeah, and this here is a 20 millimeter anti aircraft gun. And this fits that rifle right there. Oh. And so what? So what size is? Seven point seven. I bought these. Seven. I didn't. I shot all my ones I brought home. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't have no military left. So this one's live. It's fifty. It's still hot. Huh? It ain't gonna hurt you. Unless it drills. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That that twenty millimeters. The primer's been punched. Now, I shoot this at home. That's a 44 Magnum revolver. I killed my deer with it. With a 44? That's a 44 Magnum. I'm only used to seeing these mm -hmm. at the deer lace. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm used to seeing these in a revolver. Here's a pistol. Here's an old, 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 old. That's a 44 40. That was my dad, come out of my dad's trunk. What is? That's lead. Is that lead? That's yeah. Where all the bullets way back there in the 1800s had them in the steel point, they had all lead. I don't know. I've ever seen the lead. He's right here, they go in that yes, gun right there. Yeah, that's you. Yes, no. Yeah, that's I've got a Springfield Alt 6. Yeah, that's just like 